many medical devices have hidden networks inside of them. This is especially common on large devices, like MRI machines or in vitro diagnostic devices. Complicated devices like these require many independent computers, all working together in an orchestrated manner in order to run scans and tests efficiently. The user interface that is used by the clinician and is attached to the clinical network acts as a bridge to the internal network of the computers used for controlling the different parts of the device. These segmented network configurations are often considered low risk by manufacturers because the user interface computer is the only point of external communication. Thus, the internal systems are often left unpatched by the manufacturer and could be running an RTOS that is vulnerable to Urgen 11 or an old version of Windows XP. However, if that single computer becomes infected with malware, it could spread to the segmented internal network of the device. Since the internal network is not controlled by the healthcare provider, they may not even know when it is infected. Having a full and complete software bill of materials for every medical device, including its internally segmented network devices, is an important tool in fighting mass malware campaigns in the clinical setting. For more information, visit mediso.com.